On your knees. Okay, chop it off. Chop it off, let's do it. Oh, we got him now. We got him now. You know what? I'm thinking there are probably sharper stairs somewhere else. <laughs> We're thieves, but we help the wrong person steal the wrong thing and unleash the greatest evil the world has ever known. The Red Wizards created an army of the undead. Sounds lovely. Quite the opposite. I know, I was being ironic. I find irony is a blade that cuts he who wields it most especially. You're not a lot of fun, are you? <laughs> How are we gonna pull this off? We're gonna need a team. You need cool air. Follow me to the orifice. Back to school air. The orifice? I'll go last. Let's go! I don't mind that. She missed. No, oh, that's not good. Aren't you sick of failing? We can die. There's worse things than dying. I lost everything that ever mattered to me. And if we quit now, that's for nothing. I don't want to see you die, which is why I'm going to leave the room. <laughs> this ends now. The bridge is protected by an ancient trap. We must not trigger the mechanism. I may have triggered the mechanism. <laughs> so, sorry. Deadpan comedy he looks perfect. <laughs> it's a lot better than I expected. This reminds me of, okay, now you know when you have a lot of board games and those board games have turned into movie adaptations. Uh, one of them is Warcraft, uh, also known as the World of Warcraft if you play the game. And it's it was a great movie. I think it had about a $160 million budget and it made back like, what, 400 and... 46 or something like that it made basically double back what it, it actual original um uh budget was which is great and i think that film deserves a lot more recognition for what it was because it was a good film i watched in cine world back in 2016 so this was a good like um a good like six seven years ago and i thought it was, uh, I thought it was great it uh, it was it, it captured perfectly what World of Warcraft was about. I don't know much about Dungeons and Dragons. I don't know much about the game. It, I just know for a fact that it has great star power. So Justice Smith, it's got Chris Pine, it's got Michelle Rodriguez. It's it's great. It's got uh, it's got Hugh Grant. It's got a few other fa familiar faces as well. And the chemistry just seems to work well. When you have films, which are adaptations of video games or board games, the issue is that they don't seem to capture them essence of what the games are actually about but it seems like they've done a good job here i remember a few of my mates have actually worked on this and they said they had a great time as well and i am looking forward to it because i like these type of movies that actually have a good sense of balance between humor action and certain themes this year has got a lot of good films coming out and i'm just hoping pa paramount have been killing it paramount have just come out with some bangers recently and i just hope they carry on because this is literally their year well the last year or so they've been pulling out millions Millions and millions in the box office because of the great budget films. So I'm looking forward to this when it comes out in March. Hope you liked the video. Hope you liked the reaction. Like, share, subscribe, and comment. Let me know what you think. If you ever heard of, um, you know, Dungeons and Dragons, have you played a game? And do you think it's worthy of to be a adaptation in a movie? And I hope I can see you in my next video.